Hi, in this video I'll show you how you can speed up or slow down a video using Blender. Maybe some of you don't know but Blender can be used not only for 3D animation but also for video editing. So if you're looking for free open source video editor, Blender can be a very good choice. So to access the video editor we can click here on this option to choose the screen layout and then select video editing and maybe your interface looks a little different than mine over here I have selected the properties window so if you have something else here you can click on this option and choose the properties window over here we have the video sequence editor down here again we have the video sequence editor but in a different type of view now over here you can change the type of view so if I click on this option you see that this window uh, appears like this one if I click on this option I'll be able to preview the video here and down here we have the timeline also I'm going to click on this option to expand the sequencer properties window now the first thing you may want to do when you are importing a video to edit is to adjust these options here in the properties window so maybe you can adjust the resolution of the video the start and end frame this will be done later the frame rate over here I know that my videos are 25 frames per second so I'm going to choose this one and also you can select the output folder and the output file format so you can choose different file types for example xvid or maybe this one here okay so now let's see how we can speed up a video and before that of course we need to add a video in blender so I'm going to click on the add option select movie and choose this one then click on this option add movie strip and our video was loaded in blender here we can preview it this is one of my tutorials now because this speed up effect does not work on sound we are not going to need a sound file here and remember that we select with the right mouse button in blender so I'm going to right click on this here and over here in the properties we can see that this is the sound if I click on the video you see that this is a movie and of course for some reason the audio appears above the video in blender so if you're not sure which is which you can check here in the properties now with this audio selected delete key and now we have only the video I'm going to select it choose the add option effect strip speed control and over here in the properties this effect strip has a lot of options but there is a easier way to speed up a video I'm going to select the video and then over here I have the length of the video I'm going to click on it then I'm going to type slash and 8 hit the enter key and this is going to speed up my video 8 times now the next thing I want to do is to adjust the frame range as you can see here our frame range starts with frame 1 and ends with frame 250 so I need the length to be the length of the video so I'm going to click here control C to copy this number and I can enter it here or I can enter the number over here it will work just the same so I'm going to click here control V to paste it enter key to apply now let's see how our video will look if we export it I'm going to click here to play it and you see that the video is sped up eight times it's much faster than the original and if you want to slow down the video all you have to do is to actually multiply the frames so instead of a slash key here in the length of the video you can use the star shift 8 and then a number for example if you want to slow it down four times you're going to type star 4 and this way the video will play four times slower than the original and when you want to export the video after you have adjusted the options here I also choose this option keep UI and then click animation and the video will start exporting over here when it's finished it's going to go to the destination folder the output folder where you can find it you can check it out so that's it for this tutorial I hope that it was useful 
the next one I'm going to show you how to do picture in picture in Blender so if you are recording let's say a gameplay video and you want to have a small window with yourself talking or maybe something else you're trying to do I'll show you how you can do picture in picture so that's it for this one I hope you like it leave me a comment visit my channel for more and if you're new to my tutorials subscribe that's it for now bye